I work really hard, honestly, and I wake up every day and I and I work very hard at being me. And I think that a lot of the time when you see people who are who seem very confident and who are like very sure and like they're like you know kind and they don't just wake up that that that, that way. You know, you wake up in the morning, you think you know I'm going to be the best version of me and I'm going to work really hard to be that way. So. Yeah, I don't have a special power. I'm actually so human. And to be honest with you, I, I struggle with social media a lot too. Like to be honest with you guys, I deleted Instagram and Twitter three days ago. But I ask, I send my manager pictures and I'm like, can you post this? Because sometimes I need to take a break from it too. Like it gets to me just as much as it gets to anyone else. And um, yeah, you have to take care of yourself. It's really, really important. Make yourself come first, yeah. What songs hit me with a wave of nostalgia? I listen to like Treacherous by Taylor Swift. Yeah! So much. The best piece of advice I've ever been given, and by who? My tour manager, Kez, gives me a lot of incredible, incredible advice. And one thing that I really loved that he told me one day was I was, I was uh, talking about this girl, and I was like, I think I think this is what's happening and she's being like this because like because of this and he goes wait why do you think that and you and I was like well I don't know I, I just assume and he goes what do you mean assume and I'm like well I just assume that's how she feels and he goes you can never assume you know how somebody feels and I'm like what do you mean he goes like he's like if you're married to someone for 50 years you cannot assume you know how they feel because you never ever 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 know and it's the most important thing in the world and kind of changed my life is that whenever I'm in a situation where I'm like, oh no, I think this person is mad at me for any reason, I always just go, you don't know, you have no idea. So just wait for them to tell So I'm the biggest dance rapper fan in the whole world and then when he asked me to come to the studio, I, I went into full panic attack. <laughs> I was like in my hotel room meditating, being like, you're great, you got it. And I'm like, and I remember I showed up and it was like him and like 15 other people and they were working on the album and I was like so intimidated and then he started to play me music and we started to talk about it and I realized that he's just another guy who really likes music and he's just the sweetest. He, he really genuinely is so kind and so caring and so cool. I've never played in Mexico and I'm dying to play in Mexico. I think it'll be so much fun when I play there. I love redheads. I love redheads. Are you asking me because you're a redhead? Yeah. I think you're super cute.